Hi, hello everyone! This is Juliet Adventure and welcome back. Today, our recipe is Level Up Sardinas Pasta. And this is our all the ingredients that we need. So, we need spinach and of course we need Lego. There, there you go. So, you can use different kind of sardinas if you want 555 or master no problem and this one is a fettuccine you can use a different kind of pasta as well you can use spaghetti macaroni whatever you feel like to use and of course there you go so me i use the fettuccine and there you go so i use uh, olive oil if you don't have olive oil you can use a different kind of uh, oil and oregano tomato and parsley so this is the water that we need so we need going to hot water to boil our pasta so I put some uh, one spoon of salt water in a boiling water and then now I'm going to put my pasta so this one is a fettuccine so you can put any kind of pasta if you want which I told you before you can use macaroni or spaghetti So if you can see, I waited about 10 minutes for this. So now it's already cooked my pasta. So we're going to put this one in the side and then let's go cut our tomato and onion. I use my uh, my machine to cut my uh, my onion but if you don't have this one no problem you can cut it by knife but in a small pieces so there you go so this is our, our frying pan and we're going to put our garlic first with our frying pan and then after that we're going to put the onion and also to So if you can see, it's already our, on, uh, our garlic, it's already golden brown, so I put my uh, onion and then after that, I'm going to put together also the tomato. So by the way, you can uh, you can use also the Lego or sardinas. You can use red, no problem. So for me, I use the green one. So I'm going to use only two of this, two of can because we're not a lot anyway. So if it's up to you how many quantity or sardinas that you're going to use, you could use also one.
so now let's go add uh, the spinach so this one is our spinach if you don't have a spinach you can use also kangkong kangkong it's really good also it's so healthy and it's good taste as well no problem so there you have it and i put some basil There you go so I put some oregano and after this I'm going to put some bay leaf or or laurel by the way I put some uh, chicken or fish cubes they give taste or flavor with our food By the way, by the way, if you don't have the basil or oregano, you can just add some uh, um, L'Oreal or bay leaves. No problem. It can give you more taste with this one as well anyway. And after that, don't forget to put some salt. I only put some uh, half of the spoon of the salt. There you have it. Just tiny one. Just I think one spoon. That's already But if you want to put some uh, chili sauce or spicy things, you can put it, if you can add, no problem as well. So now I add my parsley, parsley or peas, parsley. So there you have it. So if you can see already, this one is also uh, give a taste of flavor. So there you go. So it's finished my, uh, our cooking. So now I'm going to add my If you can see you can smell this one it's really smells so good with the uh, oregano and basil and the laurel and it's really taste good as well so anyway I hope so there you go so it's done so bon appetit So there you go guys, I hope you love my cooking and you enjoy my recipe, even just a simple one. And don't forget, I just want to say don't forget to appreciate every kind of food they put in a table. Doesn't matter small or big, just appreciate it. And also please don't forget to subscribe with my channel and like. And also I would like to say shout out to everyone and I really really appreciate guys that you're always watching my channel and please stay safe and be healthy and be cool be nice so this is Julia saying again I love you all and take care and God bless bye for now see you soon